Welcome back guys to the Minecraft Military Force. I'm Crafty Fox and today we're going to be building the Messerschmitt BF-109. And this is a World War II German fighter aircraft. It was the backbone of the Luftwaffe fighter force. And almost 34,000 were produced in World War II. It's actually the most produced fighter aircraft of all time. And this is specifically the BF-109E and this is the White 14. And actually, apparently they found it in a swamp in like Russia and then they restored it recently. Um, but yeah, here's what it looks like. So a lot of people voted on the BF-109 uh, in the poll for the World War II uh, plane redo against the Suka and the P-51 Mustang. So um, here is actually the old version uh, built by Subby back in 2019. So a couple years ago. And at first I was having some trouble like finding how to exactly make it better. I realized a lot of things could be improved from the original design. So let's go over them. Um, the biggest change I think is uh, this Balkan Cruise logo. It's used by the Luftwaffe and I have a really large one because uh, the real life BF 109s they have this really huge one and I couldn't quite figure out like how to make it without being weird before in Subby's version it was like really small right here and then I had no idea how to make it look good so eventually I came up with this design where we have like two banners it's nice and big and in addition to that I have downsized this because apparently Subby's version it was a bit overscaled the wingspan and uh, some parts here in the back and you know the fuselage area as well so it kind of moved everything up a little bit here and we also changed up the wings so like the front part it goes up and then it goes down to its back while the other one is like the other way around. And we also do have the MK-108 machine guns here in the wings. Um, and also, by the way, we have landing gear at the bottom here, which are retractable. So if you want to make it flying, you just uh, don't make this bottom part. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it between um, the new differences. I hope you guys enjoy the design because I actually uh, was surprised how much we changed since the old one. And if you want to see more videos like this, make sure you hit that like button down below and leave a comment for the algorithm. But anyways, let's get started. So first off, let's grab some materials. We'll take out uh, another brick fence, another brick stairs, yellow concrete, daylight detector, oak slab, polished blackstone brick slab, and this grindstone. A stone brick stairs and a stone brick slab. So, first off, we're going to add in uh, another brick stairs that's going to be um, three blocks above the ground, like this. Then, on top, we'll add in two blocks tall of nether brick fence. And dangling down, we'll add two polished blackstone brick slabs. Behind, we'll add in yellow concrete, three blocks long. And then a daylight detector. And then three oak slabs. Down here we'll add in two oak slabs. Then we're going to add in four stone brick slabs. So one, two, three, four. And then we'll add in a stone brick stairs to the sides of this first stone brick slab. So we're going to face it towards the inside, upside down. Just like that. And underneath that's going to be um, this grindstone wheel. Like that. Then the inside of this, we'll add in this light gray concrete. And we're going to make it seven blocks long. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, just like that. And then the back here, we'll add in a stone brick slab. And then on top, we'll add in a deep slate brick stairs facing the front. And then a slab. And then two light gray concretes, a gray concrete, and then two black concretes. The back will add in a light gray concrete as well as this yellow concrete. And then an oak stairs facing towards the back and front, a stone brick stairs facing the front. And to the side of this, we'll add in a spruce button either side. Then we'll add in a dark oak um, trap door here. I forgot we're just building one side of the aircraft right now. Um, and then an iron trap door here. Um, all right, on the side. And then we'll add in um, this gray carpet on the inside and light gray carpet on the outside. Down here, we'll add in a black stone button like that. And then to the side of this, we'll add in um, stone brick slab like that. Iron trap door right behind it here. 
And then we'll go to the side of this, we'll add in a blackstone button and then an oak button in the front. Then on top, we'll add in an iron bar right here. In the back, we'll add in a wither skull and skull right behind it. And we want to make it go a little bit down, just like that. All right, now I'm going to make the Balkan Cruise. I hope I'm saying that right. Probably not, but whatever. Uh, so basically, we're going to go inside the loom, put in a white banner. And we're going to add in a light gray dye. And that's going to be um, on the top part. Put it back inside and put it on the bottom a third of it. Put it back inside. And we'll add in a white dye. And we're going to fill in the right half of it. And if you're building the other side, make the left half of it. So, got that shape. And then put in a black dye, put it in the middle. And then add in black dye um, on the third, where we have the white. So there we have it. That's how you make half of the Balkan Cruise logo. And to make the other side, you just do it, you know, the other way. I don't feel like I need to teach you how to do that, because it's like the same way, just the other way around. So, yeah, we're just going to add in these two banners in just like that. All right, so once we have it, we're to copy everything that we did on this side and build the other half. All right, so once you have both halves, it should look like this. Now let's work on the wings, and the wings are different camouflages. So we're going to take out a light gray uh, carpet, gray carpet, um, and this deep slate brick slab, chain, and then a stone brick slab, nether brick slab, and an oak slab. So let's go make... Um, I guess this side of the wing first. So we're going to add in um, two more stone brick slabs here. Stone brick slab to the side of this. Um, and the deep slate brick slab here. And we're going to make that three blocks long like this. Add another two over here. And then go dialing up another uh, deep slate brick slab. Two blocks long. And we're going to make an L shape like that. Add in a chain here in the front. And then two stone brick slabs on a diagonal with another brick slab there in the middle. And then two uh, oak slabs like that. And then another uh, deep slate brick slab. Um, it's going to be one diagonal to that nether brick slab. And then we're going to add in um, light gray carpet. Cover up all this stone brick slab over here. And we're also going to add in a dark oak trap door right in this nook here with a gray carpet on top and also take out an iron trap door for the other side so let's make the other side now uh we're gonna add in deep slate brick slab we're gonna add two here another one here to the side and then stone brick slab here make a two by two stone brick slab another stone brick slab here then dangling up stone brick slab two by two Add another slab here at the back. And let's add in a chain in front of this. And then we'll add in a deep slate brick slab here. Another brick slab behind it. And then two oak slabs like that. Then we'll add in um, an iron trap door. <laughs> okay, so this part right here, that's where I use the iron trap door. So delete that, put an iron trap door instead. Um, so you don't see that bottom part. All right, now I'm going to add in a light gray carpet covering up all this um, stone brick slabs except this part here that is going to be kept because we have the stairs um, so we'll just add in a gray carpet on top of that nook just like so all right now I'm gonna make uh, that little banner right there so basically what that is is uh, go inside loom light gray banner white dye and we want it on right hand column this time put it back inside Add in light gray dye border around it. Put it back inside. And then light gray dye in the bottom third of it. Put it back inside. And then we want gray dye in the opposite um, corner as the white dye. That's so like that. And we're going to add it so it's uh, right on this side. <laughs> Look at this. We need to switch these guys around. Look at that. So it looks like that. And basically for the other side, you just do it the other way around so the gray is on the other corner, um, like that. All right, so once you're done with that, yeah, that's pretty much it on how to make the BF-109E in Minecraft. 
I hope you guys enjoy the video. If you do, make sure you hit that like button down below as always. Subscribe if you had already. Check out our Discord and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.